Hey guys, I'm Brad and this is Guild Wars 2. We're continuing with Long Live the Lich. This is part five and we're just uh, left off in the pre previous video where we had to enter through an alternative entrance into the fortress. And we're gonna go in through the sewer following Bram because he ran ahead of us. So let's get started. Wow, this is a pretty messed up sewer. Where'd he go? How did he get so far ahead of me? Oh, there he is. That was reckless, Bram. It was. And, and uh, let's go find Joko. That's what I thought. Can't die. Everything can die. Only question is how. Oh. That looks like me. Is that me? Looks just like you. You have a twin? I, I didn't that. think so. You're a triplet. No, wait. A quadruplet? What? What? Why is there clones of me? What the? They're all you. What the? I know Joko's sick, but I didn't realize he was obsessed. I mean, my enemies burned me in effigy, but I've never inspired this level of whatever this is. This is bizarre. Investigate the torture chamber. I imagine a worse way to die. I'm gonna be ill. <sighs> what sort of mind comes up with crazy stuff like this? Commander, take a look at this. Green. Of some kind. An ancient skill signet. I didn't think anyone used these anymore. Focus on the ring to activate its power. Oh, it's all an illusion. The signet ring dispels it. Oh, thank the spirits. They're just regular dead people. I mean, you know what I mean. <laughs> no one deserves this. Continue into the fortress. Weird. Why am I... Why is there a spell that does that, though? Uh, where do I go further into the fortress? There doesn't seem to be a way to go. I mean, I don't see a door anywhere. Like, there's a door here, but that won't open. Use the ring to open it? Oh, I see. What does that do? Oh, I see. It's a hidden door. Whoa! What's the point of traps you can see? Deterrence, maybe? I think it's fair to say Joko's been anticipating this. So he's just playing with us? You disarmed me. I'll come with you. Oh, uh, there's... Oh, uh, really? Whoa! Good. Rather have a straight-up fight than a bunch of tricks and traps. Ah! 
Ouch. So I have to keep using the ring to look for like secrets. Oh. I'm insulted. I invite you to the biggest battle the world has ever seen. And you show up with one idiot more. I feel like you're not even trying. Left my entourage on your doorstep. Oh, I know. They'll be my entourage soon enough. I hope you feel at home. I spent so much time preparing for you. Nice to have a reason to break out the crystal. <laughs> so he was enough waiting. Cloning me in That's an illusionary way. Pace. Was he like Wait, trying to make an illusion? I don't trust an empty hallway. I think it's an illusion. The one with the fancy ring. Oh yeah, look at all the traps. <laughs> How do I get through that? Oh, I see. Yeah, this whole hallway is just a huge trap. Oh, well, there's another one right ahead. Oh crap. Oh no. Look at the sinews on those legs. What? A second one? I'm not done with the first one. No. So I guess it's all timed, but getting faster. He's summoning the third one, but I'm not even... I think he summoned the second one when I was at about 25%. Now I'm at 40% or 35 I thought maybe I would see something on, out of the ordinary, but nope. You know, you haven't even thanked me for the entertainment I've provided. Why do I have to try? Joko seems to be taking this all in good stride. Like, I'm mopping up all of his guys. 
And he's just like, oh well. Why is he goading him? So. Press on. I'm just around the corner. I really hate this guy. Just before defeat. Whoa. There's a lot going on here. No. That would smell good. You know, like a spore or something. That's actually No. There we go. That should be all of them, I think. Oh, I understand now. What you have to say all the money. You're a completionist. I love you. Like that that's an oversight, for sure. <laughs> Don't run towards the other guy. Oh my god, he's running towards the other guy. I'm gonna fight one. I'll let Bram fight the other. No! I've never liked abilities in any game where they yank you. Like, I, I just don't like it. Because it's disorienting, and, like, if they can pull you, or, you know, you know you're going to get pulled, that's one thing. Like, I kind of know the ability now. But when they yank you, it's, it's disorienting. It's like, ah... Uh... I've been at this for 20 minutes, just going through this, this fortress. That trap was annoying. Could you be here somewhere? Whoa. Wow. Check this place out. I want to take a screenshot of this. It's warded. Gotta be a way to shut it down. Oh, I see. I had to trigger that first in order to do this. So I just jumped ahead. Maybe try to rearrange them. Yep. Exactly what I got to do. limited time to do it? Oh. So 
so we meet again. Charlatan. Beast Marshal. Hope you're not mad about the whole tricked you into thinking I was Iberu thing. <laughs> on the contrary, the attack on Balthazar was the greatest military victory of my career. No matter who led it. But, Joko bids me confront you. I cannot but obey his will. Oh no. I wonder. Do they catch on fire? I thought maybe they would catch on fire, but it doesn't look like it. Where is he? Whoa, what the? Oh, I caught on fire. I see. I get it now. What hit me? Might makes me right. See if you don't miss that initial attack, he does so much damage to you. <laughs> I almost feel bad for this guy because like he he valued me like because I did I did help him military victory you know what I'm glad she's dead someone's not getting reawakened it's clear oh boy and this isn't even the final battle yet how disappointing and honestly unexpected I thought you would present better. Where the is he? Hero of blah blah blah. Rendered useless by a glorified palm trick. No, you don't. Give him one for me, Commander. I will, Bram. For you and for Tiny. That's your ace in the hole. Morons so besotted with you. They're willing to sacrifice themselves. He loves to talk. Haven't enough people already died for you. Show yourself, Joko. With relish. And that's what it's all been about. Eh? Oh boy. I already don't like the look of this room. You and I. Two comets on a collision course. War. Plague. Gods, dragons, I've seen them all. They come. And oh my they god, go he talks like so much. But a worthy nemesis, that is rare indeed. He's always been like cut this, though. Monologue. He just talks and talks Let's and talks. This. Even she says, By cut the monologue. Defense, then offense. An historic moment when I stood toe to toe with the dust. Wow, that was really annoying. Oh great, now he's summoning minions. 
Wonderful. <laughs> this I expect from him. I expect minions to be summoned. Oh, I expected him to keep running at me. Oh well. Just had to run and hit him. Now we've got two. <laughs> no. I already I admit I've indulged in a few calculated fabrications to most of my good. I want yours is more than that. Perhaps it is. What is that? Wow. Right. 
Come on, die. Whoa. You... I think you killed him. I mean, I think you really killed him. Appearances can be deceiving, but... Look, he awakened. They're in a stupor. They're not under Choco's command. We... we won! I don't know about that. He died too soon. He wasn't at zero health. Whoa. The rules of my immortality are drastically understated. Oh, Commander. You look so disappointed. So impotent. I feel for you. I really do. But let's be honest. You knew in your heart. Fear not. The world will not forget you. The scars you've gouged into it spell out your name for all to see. I confess I was happy to take credit for your victories. But did you ever stop to wonder what that says about you? That so many bought what I was selling. They call me a monster, and you a hero. The world expects Palawa Choco to dare to throw reality into chaos. But surely no mortal would be so monumentally stupid as to destroy a dragon. The life force of this world. Let alone two. And a god to boot. Perhaps they will finally thank me for luring you to me, so that I may save the world from you. Oh. And once you're gone, everyone will flock to my embrace. They will all love me, Palawa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Raise Joko. Orin just destroyed him. What have you done? Are you Is she feeding on him? to digest. That makes two of us. <laughs> Commander, you should have seen it. The primeval queens and their ghost army wiped out the third generation plague bugs. The awakened are all destroying and it's throwing down their weapons, screaming, crying. Oh man, what what's Florine eating? She's eating Joko. Her dinner. <laughs> okay, but that's not I mean I mean there wasn't It is. It was. Tell everyone to give the Awakened a wide berth. We still have a lot to mop up out there. Will do. I, I know you need some air. <laughs> oh, Tommy's, over? Tommy's gonna throw up. Oh my. Great. She's big enough to eat people now. <laughs> do not mess with Orin. Is she done yet? No, she's still feasting. No, she's not. Are we really just gonna stand here while she eats a guy, huh? Yeah. Well, I'm sure you'll all be happy to know the third generation epidemic has been averted. Just a bunch of first and second gen bugs to deal with out there. Why is everybody so quiet? <laughs> We're watching. Oh, oh, <laughs> look at all these pestilence samples. Jackpot. 
Get whatever data you need. We'll be burning all plague associated materials. What? Why? So, uh, in case you were wondering, Joko was wrong. About me being a villain? E P I D E M I C. Cabram! <laughs> Cabram. I have a point about you. You do cause chaos. Well, we do. We are a we, Bram. Like it or not. Hm. Those are my only choices? Those are our only choices. Come on. We have a lot of cleanup to do out there. Watch out! <gasps> what happened? Someone else utterly disturbed by that. Did she eat too much? Marine, are you okay? Weak roar. I think she's just full. She ate too much. Canuck? You know, I'd almost forgotten Maureen was a dragon. In my head, she was more of a person in dragon form. Of course, all this is certainly a visceral reminder. I hate to ask this, but... Do you think she would have done this before she absorbed Balthazar's magic? Or could have? It does seem to have made Krakatoric more aggressive. And it certainly changed her somehow. She's still Orin. Perhaps you're right. It's easy to forget. She's always been the granddaughter of an elder dragon. <laughs> Maybe this is just what they do. It is. I don't know why everyone's so skittish around Orin. Eating Joko was the only sure way. Makes perfect sense. Kinda wish I'd thought of it myself. What, so you could eat him? Rox, thank you for liaising between the Olmacon and our other forces. What you did was essential to our victory. My pleasure, Commander. They really are amazing fighters. But they don't let fighting define them. One of the elders told me the wisest thing. Oh, sorry. I, I, I don't mean to go on. Anyway, it was an honor to fight with them. Oh, we got Tammy. So, Commander, the Ghost Army was mopping up when we came in here. They were really enthusiastic about it. But I don't know how long they're going to stick around before they, you know, ghost away or dematerialize. Before they leave, we should ask the Sun Spears to watch for Awakened coming too and make sure they don't hurt themselves or anyone else. I mean, it's fine right now while they're all sort of dazed, but what happens when they snap out of it? I honestly don't know, Taimi, but that decision's not up to just us. An intelligent undead? Maybe a future race? Or you could be undead. Oh, and Gorik. What does Gorik have to say? Did Blish get his arm back safely? Where is he, anyway? Yes, his arm is fine. He's back keeping an eye on the rift. He's not sure now that he should have done it. He says maybe Timey's right. Maybe. And we shouldn't go around ripping holes in the fabric of space-time. On the other hand, you can't make science without breaking a few pieces of the temporospatial continuum. <laughs> Speaking of which, there's so much here to study. Okay. And with that, we are done with this. Let's see if there's anything outside of it. There may just be like a mail. I may just get a mail. Yeah, it looks like that's it, I think. The story is complete, so we're actually done done. Joko, the wrath of Joko is now over with. We don't have to worry about it. Okay, but with that, we are done with this story. And we'll move on to the next, in the next video. We'll move on to the, uh, a star to guide us. But with that, we are done. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.
Thank you very much for hanging in there to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell button so you know when I post the next video. And don't forget to comment and let me know what you thought of the video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.